What's good, Southie Nation? Welcome to our weekly recap of how we're doing in this World Cup. Uh, so we're showing you the, the progress on our main squad right now, which is the Germany squad. Uh, show you all the lines we got going on right now. We got the United States, we got England, we got Spain, we got Switzerland, we got Costa Rica uh, that we got going on. We got an amazing a master pull from the Swiss. Um, but what we're going to do, we're going to do the trade-in today so we can show you kind of what's in that trade-in. Um, pick up our very own master uh, Germany player. Hopefully get closer to that 90 overall. I'm really, really hoping for like a Ter Stegen or a Neu or something um, so that we can really boost up the keeper because that's the biggest position I think that we need to boost up right now. Um, and then obviously maybe the center back position could be good to boost up as well. Um, so that's kind of what we're looking at to do with this. we got to set our active lineup. That's a very important thing to make sure it's their active lineup because it's not going to count from that one. Uh, we'll start maybe, oh, we'll open up one of these packs. Let's open up one of these featured uh, nation packs because I love opening these small player packs. We get some good luck in them. Um, so start off by opening up this pack, see if maybe we can get something big in this. 75 and 77 overall. So definitely not going to be higher than the highest overall that we have of his right now. Um, but we're going to go in, we're going to do this exchange set. So what's interesting about this exchange set, you can do it every 48 hours. So that's kind of exciting uh, that you can do that as we go in. Got to find our master. There he is. So it is a little sad to get rid of the master card, but the one thing we can do is we can always go back, trade it back to the Swiss after and something like that, because every 48 hours you can do it again. So that part's kind of cool. We do get 25,000 coins out of this one. So yes, we are going to put this in. We are going to see what we get. I, I'm hoping that Germany is the one that we have right now. So we get this here. I'm hoping to see Neuer. Ter Stegen would be good as well, but find it out. Here we go. Master card, 25,000 coins, and we get not bad. Not bad. Ganogan there out of that one. So a decent card. I would have definitely liked to see, uh, you know, one of like the 92 overall keepers or something like that, just because it would be so much easier for us to upgrade our team with that. Um, and whereas right now in our central mid, we're not going quite quite as high there but 93 overall that brings us to an 86 still there see this is part of my issue I need to try and uh, bring up like the goalkeeper from here I could put Allison in um, that would bring me up one overall but I think even if I put in like all my goalkeepers where are we gonna be like yeah even with all the goalkeepers in we only go three higher on that so that is definitely the spot that's sort of bringing us down right now on defense as well uh, we got our center back we could bring in some players in here and maybe get a little bit of a uh, little bit of momentum on this one, so we go too higher there. Okay, so not not bad. 87 overall. So we got an 87 overall. We're getting closer to this. Um, not sure that we can do a whole lot on any of these other positions. 34 of us. So we can go one overall higher there. Um, but again, not a whole lot. We might we might do. I'll open up a couple packs. Maybe we can get some luck to kind of bring up uh, some of those cards. We can go in once we finish off our uh, set here. So I'll show you if we go into our campaign right now um, on the, uh, where is it? In the, the FIFA World Cup. So we're almost on to tier four. Tier four starts here. Uh, we don't have the 90 overall. So we did beat all the previous tiers of this one for Germany. Um, for uh, Spain, I think we're pretty far along that as well. And the verse attack here, our verse attack, we still haven't seen them actually pop up, which is a little unfortunate. Um, so we haven't haven't done a whole lot in there one, but in the in the world level, uh, not the highest. We're only on uh, 25 right now because I've really just been doing. I haven't done a whole lot of the first tag match. I've been more kind of focusing on uh, just playing the other ones. But also talking about if you're playing verse tag matches. I gotta say this, and you see one of these featured teams, and you're playing against them. They're 71 overall. You're like an 80 overall, and you're just playing the regular verse tag match. Let them win. Be nice, be a team player, because it is really hard playing those ones. Um, so usually that's what we end up doing, because and, and, it doesn't lose you anything not winning the verse stack matches in the other one, but it does definitely lose you out of those players um, if you're doing the fancy matches there. So this is what we're kind of looking at right here. Uh, if we go to group F, I think I am like one, three hours away. We need two more points out of here, which we will get when this resets. So we actually are going to get close. Now the other thing we could do is the skill boost. Um, 75 skill boost is going to be a fair amount of skill boost. So I'm kind of torn between the two. I do want to get that card, uh, but at the same time, this skill boost one, um, going in here, 200,000 coins and 75 skill boost, you could get quite a lot. Ah, man, that's tough. Quite a lot. Quite a lot out of this one. So if we put this in, we could actually build up a lot of players from around there, but then it's going to take us a little while to get to the card on this one, and I'm just not sure, like, what's going to be the best, like, sort of value for that. We do get Gomez. Uh, from there, but if we look at the skill boost right now, I kind of do want to see like with our skill boost right now 
If we look at them, three of five, 15. Some of them, see some of them, the ones to get to level four, it would be 15. So that's where I'm like, I don't really know that 75 would bring us a whole lot of the way along that one. So that's kind of my only downside of that um, is, is if we were to actually go in and do that. So the one thing we do have to do, we do have to do the match prediction for this. Um, I want to try and get to a 90 overall before so that we can do our prediction matches as we're gonna do for some of the other ones. Um, but there you go, we got two points here. So we just need to get one more from there. So basically once this resets in two hours 26 minutes we will be able to add Gomez to the team so we'll make sure we do that um, add it on show you kind of what's going on in that one so we played all our verse stack matches there so we might as well open up a couple of these packs um, in the world stage see if this can maybe help us get closer towards this we can't open up that world stage pack unfortunately uh, because you can only open it once we opened that a little while ago but here we go next one up it's not gonna happen for us in there I'd be very interested to try and pull that man of the match though definitely looking to pull that man of the match 73 overall next one up Let's see what we get. Show me something. Show me something, 77. We got like five more packs we can open up here, and then it's going to be the end of this one. So 73, 77, and there is a huge pull right there. Nice right there in that one. As we go on, I, I can definitely take that. I can definitely take that pull right there. Our first elite pull of this one, and our next one up. Another yes! There you go. That is pretty big right there. So that could help us a little bit. Not not huge probably, but definitely help us a little bit in that. And another one after Clark. This is going very well. Okay. Two more packs on here. Two more packs here. We're not going to have enough to level up our players. That's going to be the downside uh, because we're going to spend it all on these packs. So one more pack and then we'll go update the squad. We'll show you our new lineup that we got going on. Our finalized Germany lineup. I'm, I'm pretty happy with how we've gone. So we've gone again. We're not putting any points in there, or a few points in this one. Just kind of seeing what we can do with that. And we've gotten some decent. 87 is our highest overall line. Getting closer, getting closer to that 90 overall. So a little bit, a little bit of an upgrade right there. And I'll probably go in, try and train them in. But if we go there, plus one overall. So 85 overall there. 85 overall. Exchange SP3. I didn't even know I put players in that one. Okay, 87 overall. So there you go. Not bad right now. The, definitely the big positions we need to figure out what we're going to do about is the goalkeeper position. If we can fix that up, um, we'll probably be pretty close to that 90 overall. And also, uh, now we're there on our left mid side. So a few players trying to pick up. Draxler obviously is going to get replaced when we finish off in three hours time. Um, but probably won't be quite enough to get us up to that 90 overall. But this new Gungogan card really liking the look of that uh, 109 short passing can do the rainbow flick so that will be super helpful for us there you go our first master card from the germany squad our first master trade in so we're in the tournament right now and uh, we decided that what we should probably do in the tournament um is is stop here at five wins you get 25 program points and 25 program points if we can get them all for like the groups that we want we can actually claim quite a few like skill boosts and stuff um which really would take us quite a long way to do and i'm not sure i can get too much further than this Obviously, I want that 25 win, like 90 plus master tournament player. Um, but I'm thinking right now we might just go with the, the program points maybe later in this once we get a higher overall team, uh, go for some of those other ones. So we're going to do this here. We're going to claim this, and that way we can go and get ourselves Gomez there. Uh, so reset in the tournament 22 world stage points. Uh, we want to see group F. That would be nice. One group F. All right, so we get one group F1 there, not bad. Um, and then the 22 points as well. So that's gonna really help us out on that one. Uh, so if we go into here now on the world stage, we're actually gonna be able to claim Gomez. If we go into here, we got 24. And in the next hour, basically we get another 10 or like an hour and a half or whatever. Uh, when they do the next one, we'll be able to get the next, another 10. So we'll be able to get um, the, uh, uh, I don't even remember what I was going to say. We're going to be able to get uh, the skill boost as well out of there. So we might try and get the skill boost after there, but we do want to go in here, uh, get Gomez out of this one. Uh, I'm not 100% sure that uh, Gomez is the one on the lineup right now, but I'm sure we are Germany. I don't know who else we'd get otherwise as we go in and pick it up. There he is, Gomez, Mario Gomez. Not bad at all. 88 overall striker card, 75,000 um, as well of those upgrade, uh, of the training experience as well. So that should help us out. We're getting closer to that 90. He's going to swap out here. 91 overall. Not the fastest card, not maybe the best card like for stats and stuff like that, but a pretty nice card right there. Makes it 88 overall. All right, so it's reset itself. So now we can finally go in, play our final sort of world stage matches um, and actually unlock all those skill boosts. I don't know how close it's going to get us uh, to getting that 90 overall squad, but at least make a little bit of a difference on there um, as we move through this one. So this will basically be the last thing that we do in this. I was hoping that we'd be able to do a featured match for Germany, but it doesn't look like they actually have a featured match. Oh man, I didn't even make it through the zones. Um, it doesn't even look like they actually have a featured match for Germany on this one, which is a little unfortunate. 
unfortunate. Um, I don't think I've even seen a single Germany like featured match up yet, but hopefully tomorrow when they play, it will be one of those matches. So we'll look to doing that tomorrow, try and pick up some like featured matches. We'll just roll through that one because it definitely is our highest overall team. So probably our best chance of winning on that one. So we get five world stage points. So we're going to go down here, claim our group F points. So we have 24, unfortunately not quite enough to just do the math one. So we're going to have to go through and actually do it one at a time. Ooh, not group B. I want group F. So we'll probably just skip through this because I don't know that you really want to watch us open up a bunch of group F points. It's annoying. So apparently as we were trying to claim it, it was it moved over on some of them. So we trying to claim it quickly ended up claiming because when I claim it, it would go and then it would go and it would move back over to the group E when I would do it. Um, so yeah, we ended up claiming some group E points. So now we have three group E points and seven group F points. So we can't actually finish this. Um, so I guess we'll see what we can do. Hopefully we can level up our squad, but it looks like this is where we're going to end off this week. So we got an 88 overall squad for Germany. Germany. Uh, we're gonna have to wait another few hours for us to try and get that skill boost boost But maybe it's a good thing because maybe it'll like, you know, delayed enough that we actually wait We really wanted to save it in the long run anyways, but here's our squad going into this one um, Liking the look of it getting close to that 80 over 90 overall, but thank you for checking this out and stopping by It's been a pleasure as always. Stop D. Out